guys welcome back to another weekly vlog so you guys it's a snow day this is the first real snowstorm of the season and we're in february we got a couple inches of snow outside and this is back in the day normal weather for new york around this time so i'm just thankful god thank you for the snow we needed it <gasps> I hate to say this, but I'm actually about to go outside in this because I want to run to the bank and then I also want to go and get a couple of groceries. So I'm going to just take y'all with me. Look at all y'all. Say hi, baby. Say hi. Say hi, baby. She just be staring. She just be watching me and judging. I can tell you my problems, meditating my silence. But I keep pushing my pen, rotating my stylus. Brokenness feeling like sin, not no breath, low dollar. Used to be left on red, now all the girls go holler. Now all the girls go follow. All the fake friends gon' pile up. I need peace to borrow, get that shit right back tomorrow. Somehow all the fans go bravo, smile so much to hide my sorrow. Stay this shaky in Verado. Okay, I know I look crazy and all, whatever, I don't even care. Legit left Whole Foods, and I just have to say, <sighs> They're doing flower arrangements for free. Buy whatever bouquets and they'll put them together and make a whole arrangement for you. They got 24 roses, two dozen roses for only $24.99. They have everything set up. So if you're not, unless you don't got the money to, if you're not showing the people in your life that you love them in some way, form, or fashion, then let's take it as you don't. Good morning, beauty. Oh my goodness okay so it's a new day um one of my bestest friends is in town so we're going to breakfast so i figured i would take you guys along with me to go to breakfast um it'll probably just be like little clips and stuff because i don't get to see them that often so since i don't get to see them that often i kind of I'm a very intentional person. My love language is quality time, so I'm very big on just making sure that the time I give to people is quality. So giving people and the ones that I love my undivided attention. So yeah, I won't really be trying to vlog. I'm more so just gonna get little clips of us here and there and just like make this breakfast intentional kind of thing. She wanna know me, I stay low key, I'll cast no breaks, baby, let them hold sleep. Body on to make your girl OD. I get in my way, never out of my lane. Feel like you the one and I'm on one. So what is gonna be? Baby squad up, we finna go deep. Riding on a team, got what you need. Baby, won't you keep me company? Give me something to do when I get lonely. They sent me like wax beads, the pot, all that stuff. And y'all know I'm a laser girly. I don't laser every area of my body. I laser Brazilian and um, I laser my underarms. That's all I get laser for. So I need to record a video for them for using the wax. And your girl's gonna wax her legs and I'll be able to be waxing my legs from home and maybe even do my underarms a little bit. Who knows? Um, so yeah, I have to do a full video for them. They asked for content from moi. 
and I'm so glad to be, you know, getting these deals. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. He's the only one getting me these deals. So, whew, turning up the heat. Yeah, let me turn that off so y'all can hear me for a second. Yeah, so I'll see you guys at the stores. I'm over here ready to ask an employee for help, and then I realized it just hit me. Walmart employees never know where something is. So I'm better off just looking around for myself. Found them. Hey beauties, so look who I'm here with. Hi. My Emma. nephew. It's his birthday. Happy birthday to me. Say happy birthday in the comments, you guys. He turns 11 years old today. Right now, I'm taking him to get a fresh cut for the birthday. Are you excited? Yes. I'm excited for him. Jose. Say hi. Getting his haircut. We'll see the after. So I never got to show y'all Zay's haircut. Look at but it. It's not. It's from the good place, though. I got a fresh clean. Yeah. Period. Ooh, ooh. Cut going crazy. And I'm here with the family. They're all in town. Say I don't want to be posted. Oh my god. Hold on. All the fam is here. We're about to sing happy birthday to the kid. Let me show y'all the cake. Oh, you put me on your vlog? <gasps> yes, darling. Oh, I know. Hello. Now you're on YouTube. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> he got a car cake. <laughs> uh, Zay? Zay? And the Costco yeah, cake. The, the official yes, Costco cake. Why are you laughing? <laughs> it was yeah. home, was it's just jokes in here. I don't know what everyone's laughing about. I'm just here. Um, but we're about to say happy birthday. I'll catch y'all another day of the vlog. Hey beauties. So I just got in the house, heating up my food. My house is such a mess right now, but I just got a package. I had won this giveaway on Instagram from these beautiful faith-based businesses. So this is my giveaway prize. So I'm like, unboxing. Oh, I got a little card. All right, let me open my card first. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you for covering who brought this here and Lord bless the business and the hands that made these. Amen. Oh, these are so pretty. I got roses. Hold on, let me try to make some nice counter space. Oop, the water is dripping. I don't know from where. This baby traveled far. The business is based in Texas and they normally do overnight shipping, but this is the giveaway, so I didn't expect them to overnight ship this. You know, they've got to pay to do everything and probably to ship overnight to New York with this heavy bouquet was probably very pricey. But it's so beautiful. So look, you guys, they're beautiful. Gorgeous flowers. I'm thankful. Thank you. I will leave uh, the business below. I also did win a candle, but that didn't come in yet. So both the businesses right here, they're faith-based businesses. I highly recommend to order from them and, you know, get you some faith-based candles and floral arrangement. They can do it all when it comes to the floral arrangements, whether it be setting up for a proposal or Valentine's or a birthday florals. You want to give her a hundred roses, they could do all of that. I highly recommend. And I'm thankful for my flowers. They're so beautiful. Beauty is good morning. It is bright and early. Finished working out. Um, I have teeth 
whitening strips on so don't mind if my mouth looks funny it's because of the strip but i'm currently getting ready I'm about to do my makeup put on some lashes because i got stuff to film but also you guys i'm finally getting my passport i am like so excited and i guess a little nervous because this means no one in my immediate family has their passport like we just stay in the country that's it no so i'm i'm just excited because it's like wow i took the first step in like being able to get out the country and see the world so yeah i'm basically getting ready for my passport appointment right now i have a half hour to get ready but i know once i start talking it could take a while so we're gonna kind of speed this up and speed this along but i'm just so where is my eyelash glue why when i need to do something or i'm in a rush do things just want to go up missing okay here it is but yeah i'm so excited like wow i am getting my passport i'm proud of myself i want my whole family to get their passport so we can see the world that god created and take this as a sign if you don't have your passport go and get your passport i'm 29 years old you guys and i've only seen america <laughs> what i don't know life is meant to be lived you guys life is a gift as well and i know there's things that god put us on this earth to do yes but he also did put us on this earth to enjoy as well i look so tan i don't know if it's just me but probably because i'm so moisturized but yeah i just i'm going places i'm going places my life is on the brink of changing for the best and I'm excited. I'm going into this next chapter excited. Like, I turned 30 this year. I got a couple of months to say I'm still in my 20s. And then the, end, the rest of this year will be me being a 30-year-old woman. Ooh, God is amazing. Thank you, Jesus. But it's just like with me being at the age that I am and I'm just now 29 and I'm getting my passport, like, it's time to start living life. I didn't really know what to expect in my 20s. I kind of didn't go into it with any sort of plans except for the fact that I wanted to make sure that I was chasing my dreams. But then I got in the midst of wanting to find love and, and all those things. And, and you live and you learn. And now here I am at 29 and I feel good. I'm living life. I'm not married. I don't have any kids. I have responsibilities. Of course, I have my own place and everything. But like, I feel like the world is my oyster. Just as an adult. Like, your 30s, I feel like... I'm going into my 30s as the world is my oyster but i have so much knowledge and of course income coming in and while taking care of my responsibilities i want to enjoy like my 30s are gonna be the best some of the best years of my life marriage kids traveling abroad seeing the world like what so i just feel like i'm in preparation you know for for all of those things like even me trying to be consistent in the gym like i want to be healthy for my future family i want to be healthy for myself of course but just like i want to get to my weight goals i want to be like in the best shape i've ever been in i'm gonna be a wife one day i already am a wife but i'm gonna be somebody's wife coming soon so it's just like let me prepare myself for these things while i'm in waiting and i know the things that i want and also because i've made it this far already i'm 29 guys i'm not settling like i'm not settling i'm going to get exactly what i want and what i need for me there is no settling yeah um sheesh seven minutes went by already and i've only put on lashes and that's the problem <laughs> is because we have or had a half hour and i've taken up like 10 minutes of it to put on lashes so now i have 20 minutes to get out the house and i still need to curl my hair and then i need to just make sure i'm not late to the appointment i don't know how that works at the post office like but yeah i know i always be running a little late i also want to focus on being on time for things one of my best friends stanley you guys know him freaking my camera's dying and this is my fault i should have charged my camera last night but it's okay but stanley is always on time legit always on time for everything if not early now i'm not saying i'm trying to be early for things but i definitely want to be on time for them it also just shows a level of appreciation and care for like 
other people's time when you make sure that you're on time for something so yeah I want to start doing that I'll come back on when my makeup is done because my camera's dying anyways and I'll just say a few things before I go get my passport okay so I'm all ready my hair I curled it a little bit and yeah we're ready to go get our passport picture so if you guys could picture the uh, lighting's probably better this way yeah so if you guys could picture my passport I'll smile like this